even for just a second? It's a safety switch in case the operator feels faint, for example. That's why I've always loved traveling with my mom by train. Trains get from point A to B within the given time they're programmed, and they're safe. Programming is the best! Have you always wanted to drive a train? I always want to be a driver, yes. But my true dream is to be an astronaut, to drive a rocket across the universe. I decided to operate trains so I could be here while Max was growing up. A space mission lasts several months. I can never be away from my Maxie for that long. But now my son's a young man. My mom's taking the exams to start her astronaut training. That's amazing. I'm expecting the test results today. You have no new emails. It's too early, Mom. The official document's at 11 a.m. You'll get them during the train ride. If I pass the test, this trip will probably be my last. The next time I drive, I'll be manning the controls of the space shuttle. Taking the next space crew to the moon. You have an 89.7% chance of passing. That still leaves a 10.3% chance of failing. I believe in you. You're the best. You're only going for the day. Why do you need such a huge suitcase? I have to be prepared for anything Chloe needs, Daddy. In the event of a hair crisis, in case Chloe wants a cup of her favorite tea. I'm proud of you, sweetie. To protect and serve, that's our Rancom Free Family Month. Hurry up, Sabrina. Hurry Chloe's waiting on you. See you tonight, Daddy. Mm -hmm. All right, that's it. You're getting a fuck. <sighs> I can't feel any negative emotions anymore. What's gone wrong? Where's my Akuma? Final boarding for train number 8065. Platform number 23. I'm finally you're here. You're probably going to be hot in those clothes, Chloe. May I remind you, Miss Bustier, that it's always cold in London. Don't worry, Chloe. I've got heating pads and an English weather survival kit. Oh, what now? Where are you two going? Our car is this way. It's all right, Miss Bustier. The mayor of Paris made arrangements for his daughter to be in first class. I'm just taking Chloe's suitcase there. I'll be right back. <sighs> You're still here. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Come back now. Do you need anything? I want my seat completely reclined. Yes, of course, Chloe. Sickness, and I know Marinette always has a solution to everything. 
I get it, but she's asleep right now, as you can see, and she's super exhausted, so... I can help you, Lila. I have just what you need in my suitcase. Thanks a million, Sabrina. You're so sweet. <gasps> Something's not right. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, Sir Cable will be under the CD and the channel tunnel in just a few moments. Awesome. <laughs> not sweetie i'm sure there isn't an akuma on board at all it's probably just some frank your daddy doesn't have a clue it really is an akuma it's definitely an akuma i should know i was once akumatized myself there's zero risk to anyone now anyway since the amazing queen bee has shunned the car doors taking the akuma prisoner That's why I lost touch with my Akuma. It's too far out of range. There's another problem. Adrian's class is on the train, and your son is on the passenger list. He's up in space, and there's nothing I can do. I'm sure Ladybug and Cat Noir will rescue him. Hoping that my enemies will save my son. How ironic. This is...
Lady Luck? But how did you get here? Teleportation, courtesy of the Horse Miraculous. And you? I was already on the train. Lucky, huh? Just like what they say about black cats. No one must know that you were one of the passengers. There are hundreds of people on the train. I'm just a cat in a haystack. Well, I guess you're right. Let's go and stop Star Train. Why don't we use the Horse Miraculous to teleport the train back to Earth? That would be pointless. She can make the train take off again just as quickly. We must capture the Akuma first. But if we do it while the train's up here in space, we'll all freeze and have no air to breathe. Which is why we must first reach Star Train, then capture the Akuma and teleport back to Earth at the same time. Ladybug? Have you been on the train with us the whole time? Of course not. We teleported here using a special miraculous. We're handling this. Gather everyone together at the back of the train, please. Of course. Everyone, please follow me to the back of the train. I hope you remember to bring my miraculous. Uh, actually... We didn't know you were going to be here. Otherwise, we would have, for sure. <laughs> Reinforced plexiglass. Unbreakable. Except for my... Cat. Wait, we might need it when we're face to face with Star Train. Max! Huh? Looks like we have some intruders. You better give up if you don't want to fly too close to the sun. <laughs> well done. Max, Marco, we need you to come with us to open the next door. But isn't it too dangerous? We'll protect you. You two make an awesome pair, too. Just like me and the lady.
looks like I kind of got the spatial coordinates wrong. Well, I heard that your class was supposed to be visiting Big Ben. Miraculous your first and last field trip. That's okay. At least I got to see Big Ben, right? Sure did. No one's seen it as close up as we did. Too bad we got separated at the end. We'll go back there together someday. See ya. Oh no! Poor Adrian! This trip was a total disaster. A total disaster. Really. <gasps> 